What is going on, everybody? Attack on Titan Season 1, Episode 20. Uh, we left off last episode with the... I don't know if this is the first time they've ever captured, like... I really don't even know what to classify the Titans as. I, I'm gonna say Big Titans and then everybody else. I don't know if this is the first time Mankind has ever captured a Big Titan. And by Big Titan, I mean on the scale of, like, Aaron, Female Titan, Armor Titan, Colossal Titan... Um, and I think even the characters have, and I have as well, we've all come to the conclusion that there are hum those other titans, those big ones, they're all being controlled by humans. I think that's 100% you can make that conclusion. So I think they're all in a situation like Eren. So there's a female inside that, there's a human female inside that titan controlling it, just like I think there's a male controlling the armor titan and another male controlling the colossal titan. Um... We left off last episode of them capturing her. Um, for some reason, I don't think she's going to stay put. I think she'll break free or something will happen. And I honestly think we kind of might not find out who's in there. She's going to escape or somehow barely get away um, and then not be able to catch up. Or maybe Aaron has to like try to like battle her down in his Titan form. Um, I kind of feel like they will find out who it is, who the female, who the actual human is in there. Why are they... So they can find out why, like, why are you attacking humans? What are you doing? Like, all that kind of stuff. But I kind of want her to get away just to keep the mystery going. I mean, Attack on Titan is just a huge mystery, the whole anime in general. Um, that's what I've gathered in the first 20 episodes. And I would like to just keep the, keep the guesses going. Um, so I kind of would like it if she got away. Um, or maybe right before she gets ripped out, the Colossal Titan touches down and snatches her up and disappears. Um... But it should be insane, um, and let's jump right into it. Nothing really more to discuss. All the social links are in the description, the Twitter, the Instagram, the Twitch, which we're going to be starting probably next weekend. Um, and yeah, that's about it. We are pressing play on the episode right now. Nope, right now. There we go. All right, let's get it. And, like, the only reason I, the only other thing I can't draw a conclusion on is, like, we know that every time, um, Aaron inflicts pain or something happens like that, um, we get the lightning spark and he either turns into a titan or a partial titan or whatever you want to make it, um, but, like, every time the Colossal Titan shows up, it's like he shows up out of nowhere. And he disappears out of nowhere. Or maybe we, as a viewer and as the humans, just haven't been paying close enough attention. Maybe he is a human doing just like Aaron, like, focusing on something or causing pain. And it just happening. And maybe when he disappears, he turns back into a human. But they're just, he causes so much destruction that no one's looking to see, like, oh, wow, there's a human right where that Colossal Titan was standing. Um, but maybe maybe he is actually summoned. Um, I don't know. There's a mystery behind that for sure. So can we talk about who knew the plan and who didn't know the plan? Like, she looks really concerned. <laughs> oh, man. I'm ready for this for sure. That's the only thing I can't, like, I can't, like, give an explanation to is, like, we see what happens when Aaron does it. We see his body, lightning, titan. We see when he goes back down, he's there. Um, but every time the colossal titan and the armor titan have shown up, maybe the camera just isn't on it or they're trying to distract us, but we don't see it, it happen from a human and we don't see a human body left over. So... And they keep bringing up that damn key. OK, 
Okay. So we have, after this, we have four more episodes. So we'll be done with season one. I'm going to try to get two episodes up, maybe three next week. So we should be done with season one by the, the 22nd or the 23rd of June. And then we have to get through 12 episodes by the 22nd. We have to get through two, four, six, eight. I'd still be four episodes short. Hmm, what if I did three? Three, six, nine. If I did 12, I'd finish just in time. That's a lot, though. We'll see. We'll try. We'll try. All right, here we go. Erwin Smith is the title of the episode. Wow, okay. Wow, they're just lighting her ass up. Jeez, for all the damage and body she killed. And that's where she'll escape. I haven't seen Mika in a while. Yeah, so it was already set up. So, like, people knew about the plan. Because just like he said, they didn't ride in there with all those cannons and everything, so they must have already had this set up, maybe... Because they knew they were going that route and it just happened to be used to capture her or. Well, that Titan was really climbing up there. Oh, wow. Yes, he doesn't trust you at all. He thinks one of them is the person. Hey, that's why he didn't tell it. He thinks the person in the survey corpse is the Titan. Somebody working double, some double agent duties. So he didn't tell anybody. So she would come out or attack or do whatever.
Oh. Okay. Okay. That's who killed the Titans that were captured. Okay, okay, okay. We're connecting dots. Okay. I mean, of course, that person's going to want to destroy the Titans so they don't find any secrets or anything. But then it's so crazy because then it's like, where was that human living all that time? Like before the first wall went down, like, was she living out there with the other Titans? Was she always in the group? Even from the beginning before the wall went down, it was just waiting for the colossal Titan to attack. Like she already knew that was going to happen. I don't know. Like, I get answers and I get more questions. They lit her ass up. Okay, okay. And what, what makes it crazy is that, like, so we know, we think, Aaron was always born a human and then maybe he was experimented on and turned into a titan. But he still has allegiance to humanity. So what would make female that's inside this titan um side with the titans if she was experimented on like Aaron, which i don't know if she was or not i don't know um why would she not side with the humans and help them they're just messing around honestly what the flying fluff was that? What are we, airbenders now? We just create elements? Because she just made ice. And that was Levi too, wasn't it? No, it wasn't Levi. Okay, they're just calling it Harden, bro. That looked like ice to me. Everybody go in. Oh, they're going to fire cannons at it. Dang. Man, she is locked in there. Is that Levi? I think she's going to escape for sure. Because it's, it's looking too good in their favor.
Like, it's going too good. Like, they capture her too easily. And they're just over here testing out different methods. I feel like she's going to escape for sure, and they're not going to get any answers. Is that one hanging right out of her eye? She better go Super Saiyan. Yo, bro. Is she like signaling? She's like, send the rest. And like, it just starts swarming the forest with titans? Or what is that? Because that is loud. Is the ground going to start shaking and we just get a titan stampede or what? She did call the rest. And there we go. That's like the signal call, bruh. She sent her own smoke flare off in the air. Oh, they're all abnormal, so they're going to be like running. You know Mikasa is going to go in. Yo, don't sleep on my girl Sasha. Sasha's a real one. I would love to see just like a hundred abnormals just swoop in. They ran right past him. They're going for her. They're going to break her free. Okay, that'll do it. Oh my god. They're like 20 deep already. They're going to break her free. I'm trying to figure out how she has that much, like, call and command, though. I mean, it looks like they're dropping them, though. Maybe they won't. But even if they can get her free just a, Oh, my God, they're everywhere. If they can get her free just a little bit, she should be strong enough to, like, get out. He knows it's over, yeah. They're not going to be able to hold. They're not going to be able to hold. She's going to get free. He had to make a decision, like, do I sacrifice them, or... For the hopes that they hold them off, or... Call him back. He already sacrificed enough. Oh, so they ate her. They weren't coming to break her free. Wait, 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 wait. Time out, time out. I mean, I'm going to talk about that after the episode, but let me read this. 
Hold on, hold on, hold on. She didn't give out a cry for... She didn't give out a cry for, hey, come break me free. She gave out a cry for, yo, you gotta come eat me now or they're gonna find out what's going on. Time out, time out, time out. Time out, time out, time out, time out, time out. Wow. So we, we're never going to find out who that is. Because if she's dead, if she just got eaten. But then I don't even understand, like, Titans don't eat Titans. So, like, even... Oh... Uh, my head's going to explode. <laughs> my head is going to explode. Oh, God. This ending is going way too good for them not to get smacked in the face right now. This is ending way too peacefully right now for them not to get... Is that the girl that was just a titan? That's not the captain. That's the girl. But then what the fu- Let me not- Hold on. was correct they can still move to a degree after regaining human form so she crawled away or something if they prepared 3d maneuver gear in advance the person inside the female form titan is wearing our uniform right now okay bodies are being dropped that's the female titan I told you this was going way too good. We're not going to see a face. Yo, f me, bro. Me, man. Oh, my God. We didn't... <laughs> I mean, no, the episode was great, but like, we didn't accomplish a damn thing. We didn't find out anything at all. Um, yeah, that was my question right there. I was, uh, That's what I was going to ask, but I just got my own answer. I was going to say how do you like introduce this female titan have her stretch over like three four episodes build her up as someone that like infiltrated when the wall went down five years ago and build all this up just for her ass to get eaten and die um 
Because what I thought happened was she signaled for whatever Titans were in the area just to come, like, just fluff shit up. Knock down the trees, knock down the cannons, the wires on her, so she could at least, like, wiggle free a little bit and then get out. Um, but they ate her. And everybody keeps telling me, Titans don't eat Titans. Titans don't engage Titans. So, like, what is that cry or scream programming into them that would even make them want to, A, follow the screen and then be actually consume her um i thought it was really interesting that erwin called back to all his dudes because even if they just kind of waited and could have just wait to see like look over the trees to see like what human do we see um oh man that's crazy i see why erwin told levi to, you know you got to gas back up because they're gonna have to hunt this chick down um but, is she, can, but can she go right back into it? Because we know Aaron, you guys keep telling me Aaron doesn't have control over it every time. He can't just, like, spam it back and, like, it takes a lot of energy and tired. Um, but, I mean, she looks good to go to me, and I feel like she's probably got it under control a lot more than Aaron does. So I feel like she just sliced that dude, right? Um, if she kind of ducked off behind a couple trees and got away, and then whatever she does, bite her hand, however she does it, turns right back into a titan, she could just kind of dip and disappear. Um, I don't know. There's a lot of intrigue and questions and stuff rolling on there. That was a great episode, though. That The last couple episodes have been kind of, like, slower. Um, especially the last one where we got, like, the flashback inside of the episode. Um, that was good, though. I like the... That was my question. Like, was she... Has she always been a human that could turn into a titan? Um, because I don't... I, I maybe missed some of the dialogue there when Erwin said it happened five years ago when the wall went down. So I'm saying like, was she always in the survey corpse just waiting for something to happen to then sprout and kind of like sabotage behind the scenes? Was she always outside of the wall with other Titans just kind of waiting for something to happen to where she could infiltrate? Um, but even then though, it's like she, she figures she's got to go through the recruiting process and stuff. Well, he said he only kept, he only told the people that were closest with him. So who knows? She could have recruited and worked her way up. And um, I don't know, just questions on top of questions. But I thought it was a great episode. One of the better ones we've had so far. So we have four episodes left. We're going to cut it really close to that deadline. But I'm going to try to uh, get as many of those episodes in as we can. So like, share, favorite, subscribe. This will go up um, Sunday early morning, like maybe 2, 3 a.m. Or like 10 a.m., something like that. But you'll see it on Sunday. Um, and maybe we'll try to get another one out on Monday. Like, share, favorite, subscribe. All the social links are in the description. And as always, 